you're about to witness is strictly personal. A direct, undiluted, unrehearsed, uncensored interview. My role is that of a reporter. The mention of my first guest's name has been known to strike fear into the hearts of brave men and women. I'm Mike Wallace. I'm Mike Wallace. I'm Mike Wallace. I'm Mike Wallace. He was tough as nails, never took orders from anybody. Why are you sometimes such a prick? <laughs> People didn't ask tough questions back then. You invented that genre. You're not answering the specific question that I put. You ask tough questions that get behind the facade. I've never seen an interview that you did not dominate. It was my first. I'll ask the question, please. You're a son of a bitch. Do you know that? Oh, come on. You are Barbara. a son of a bitch. But the folks at CBS News said, come up with an idea. This is 60 Minutes. We were experimenting. We were trying to find out what worked and what didn't work. Nobody thought it was going to last. That's when we began to do the real investigative stuff. We were doing things that were revolutionary. No right to be here, I ask you to leave. People started to tune in to see what Mike was going to be up to next. There is a new billionaire in town. Trump's the name. I don't think it's journalism. I think it's show business. Television journalism has been coming under recent criticism. Some polls have shown that public confidence is eroding. U.S. Army General William Westmoreland today filed suit against CBS Incorporated. The press is contemptible. I'd like you to get out of here. Are you aware that what you are doing is seriously endangering people? If you've got a hell of a story on your hands, go after it. Temptation is for television news to go easy. Is Russia a democracy? What we're defending is the people's right to know.